Oh, hi there. I didn't see you there. Welcome It's been back. five okay. million years. It's been 84 years. 84 years. Yeah, it's been way too long. Busy schedule. Yeah. Vacation. Mm-hmm. Wasn't here. We're yeah. back. I won't belabor the point. We have a game to finish. We still will finish it. Sorry for the okay. hiatus, everybody. But we're back. Stronger and than ever. I don't know what the... Fuck. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening anymore. Were we supposed to like talk to people or something? I think we were going around and talking to the people on the ship. We were kind of in the process of doing that. We started on floor three because it's where we left off the other time. And then I think we've done everything else. And we're ready to... No. We're ready to progress at that point. Let's double check the quests. Yeah, we gotta turn that one in, but... That's fine. So I think we were just kind of having conversations. I don't even know if we talked to Musei yet. We talked to... Those two. We talked to those two. I don't think we Crow. talked to these two. No. Yeah. Because we were like, oh, Muse's dress is clipping through the floor. How terrifying. Sorry. My camera is not on center. It's very annoying. You hate to see it. You know, it's been a few weeks. I'm a little rusty now. <laughs> so very unprofessional. Yeah, we actually got ahead with the last batch of recordings, and then some other stuff happened. And, mm -hmm. uh, and yeah. Yeah. I won't bore everybody with all the details, nor would I or could I in some cases. Like, talking about one of my issues at work would be a massive HIPAA violation. Uh, but suffice mm -hmm. to say, a position has been open for almost three months now, and, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. A position on a seven-person news team being open is a lot of extra work to dole out. Uh-huh. But luckily, I think that's coming to an end this week. I say I think because I know the hiring has cleared, but I'm not going to be 100% positive until the person is in the building <laughs> and I can see them tangibly. <laughs> that's fair. So Can't trust anything anymore. I, I won't jinx anything, let's put it that way. Yeah. All right, we talked to those two. We talked to them. So we at least cleared this room. What else have we done in here? I think we already took the spa scene. And then after that, I don't know. Yeah. I don't I'd, think we talked to them. I don't think so. That <laughs> Randy just staring at a wall. Randy, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm not going to worry about that. It's fine. Let Randy do what he wants to do. We're not, you know, we don't concern ourselves with that. Maybe he's just really drunk right now. And, it, and it's just manifesting with him staring at the wall. Yeah, why are you wearing this god-awful atrocity again? We specifically put you in the other outfit for a reason. <sighs> Stupid. Hey, every little effect you can add to your quiver of arrows on the battlefield. If that m momentary lapse of concentration gives her an opening to kill someone, she's the winner. Yeah, and then the person who got distracted is a stupid idiot. And they die. See, it's natural selection. Sort of. Sort of kind of. I hate it. Lascivious. You probably wouldn't, Duvali. And for that, I'm proud of you. Actually, I've touched him again. Oh. What else you got? Pray. <laughs> Are we like in like Game of Thrones? <laughs> or Fire Emblem. Or Fire Emblem. <laughs> okay, so nothing new here yet. Ah, there's a Yuna. We couldn't see her before. There's a Yuna? So Randy's not staring so at Randy the wall. So Randy is actually staring at a person. He's okay. done it. Okay. Okay, this is the same. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. It really does, yeah. <laughs> she was just completely blocked by uh, Sharon over here. I'm sorry I ever doubted you, Randy. That's my fault. Tonfa. That's the thing that she uses. Mm -hmm. I never, like, thought about what they were actually called. I just know them as, like, the Talum swords from Soul Calibur. <laughs> Pretty much. It's not my only other exposure to them. Yeah. Yeah, that was my first exposure to Soul Calibur. 
And I was like, wow, this is so cool. You know, my, my, my like seven-year-old brain was really excited. Yeah, admittedly, Soul Calibur was my first introduction to several different types of weapons. Also true. Um, prior to Soul Calibur 2, I had never seen, you know, a Tanfa. I don't know what the sword version of that is. Is it the, called the same thing or a different thing? Let us know in the comments. And then, like, that weird hoop. That Terry uh, uses? Yes. Uh-huh. Whatever the hell that thing is. It's like a ring blade or something. I don't know if it has a more formal name than that. Yeah. Um, um there's probably did we other talk weapons. to them? Did we? Um, did we? Let me look I around and see who's did. around here and see if it triggers my memory. Yes, we talked to We did. We Olivier. talked to these folks as well. I think. I'm pretty sure. I think so. Yeah. So Leonor's we should be good on this floor. Maybe driving. we're working our way down. We, yeah. I guess we can turn this in even though it won't really matter at the moment. Ooh. Oh, well, I forgot about that. I knew it wasn't going to help our total rank, but we did just Courtesy need a little bit more to get to 300, and sure enough. Mm -hmm. That reminds me of the song from Zysteria. You had it tough. The Rising Up. Ah. That song is great. Best of luck. I need to go and download some of those songs, actually. Um, there was a stretch of time where I didn't have an iPod, so there was no reason to like get any songs, and I just listened to everything on YouTube. So my iPod is desperately um, lacking some certain songs. A lot of from, people have done that. Yeah, from like the 2013 to like 18 range. I, I, I'm missing a lot of things. So 50 to all four stats and break damage plus 50%. In the other game, I think I would have welcomed this. In this game, I'm sort of nonplussed about it. Yeah, breaking is not as big of a deal this time around still good, but it's not, like, mission critical. What is your background? I like the background. What is that? Uh, it's Spice and Wolf. <gasps> it's Spice and Wolf? I think I can minimize this without ruining everything. Yeah. Oh, I love it. I oh, can't see that. No, they can't see it, so we're uh, just being excited about... I suppose about... I could show it. <gasps> Here's yes. where I dox myself. <laughs> the hell with it. Why not? <laughs> we get all the time in the world. We do. Um... How is this going to work? <laughs> I can't window capture the entire desktop because the recording software will be on top of it. Or will it? Hmm. I don't know. I won't be able to see if it actually displays properly. I don't have my other window up. Uh, uh, I can probably just do it as an image. That'll work. Sure. And then it is... Uh, this is the greatest thing the most that's fascinating thing for the viewers right now who can't see shit. <laughs> there, and then here, and then here... And now it's probably now taken over the whole screen for the viewers. So let's yes. get back to it more. It's a 4K because I have a no. big ass shiny monitor. Yeah, there it be. There's the one. Ah, Spice and Wolf. The show is delightful, everyone. You should go watch it. I think the art's super pretty. It's also exactly what I want out of a desktop background, which I don't know if my cursor is visible, but like the left hand side is super dark because that's where my icons are. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, whereas the right side can be whatever it likes to be, and that's fine. Yeah. But if I had to pick one, I have like a bunch of these rotating. In fact, it just changed as we were speaking about it. Yes, yes, um, it did. But if I had to pick one, it would probably be that one, just because of the composition, uh, the subject matter, all that jazz. Yeah. Uh, okay. Hooray. So, second floor has another card opponent. Oh my god, we must kill them. It took me a second to figure out that they were talking about music. Because I saw the Northern Rock, and I was like, is it what? <laughs> you got the perfect voice for Northern Boulder. <laughs> <laughs> it took me like two oh. seconds. And Tatiana's neck. Approaching them from straight on no, appears to Valerie. have been a mistake. Oops. Sorry, Valerie. I got your name wrong. Um, <laughs> your neck snapped. I'm sorry. Her neck is back to normal. Everything is fine. Everything is good. She's alive now, so she'll be upset if I get her name wrong again. Another energy drink, I see. Mm -hmm. Really just looks like Sprite, though. So. Burn in the midnight oil. Mm -hmm. Got to be ready to go. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. Sydney's like a failure or something. That's what I remember. <laughs> Okay, I don't remember him getting specific. I just remember him being a failure <laughs> about hmm. something. 20%. Yeah, it's about right, actually. That's better than Ash. we usually do. Yeah. Hmm. 
don't worry, she'll fall for you because you'll do something cool like one time and then she'll be like, oh my god, Sydney, you're so cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sydney, you've got to stop oscillating between outcomes. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. That's because Ash is surprisingly chill. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's kind of becoming my like spirit am animal more and more as time goes on. He just says things, and I'm like, yes, I relate to you so much. On this game needs more characters who just say whatever the hell's on their mind. Yes, we need more cynicism. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little bit too much goody two shoes. We have in this group. a lot of goody two shoes, which is why Usus, my favorite brat child, is my favorite character out of everyone because he is kind of he is sort of like that. That he, I is not supposed to be there, by the way. Uh, uh, well, I, I is the scriptwriter. Script I, I yeah, that's yeah, that yep. Just as a scriptwriter, I felt obliged. Yes, to... exactly. Mm -hmm. That's how you write dialogue. Yeah, we have a decent amount of cynical, mm -hmm. but probably not enough, especially considering how the events are going, right? Oh yeah, one hundred percent. We I don't want the whole it. party to be or anything. Oh sort, no, just... no, sure. We don't need the pendulum to swing completely to the other side, but you know, somewhere in the middle would be good. Because more of our, like, realists and cynical folks are temporary. You know, they're not, like, the main party. It's true. But, like, everyone in our main party is, like, super positive. Except for, like, two people now. Eustace and Ash. And then everybody else is just, like, positive. <laughs> and a lot of that has to do with Reen. But, nonetheless. Yeah. That's this side. We're going to go back through. Get all those people. Oh my god, it's just a cluster in there. Yeah, it's the cafeteria. These things happen. Oh, that makes sense. I was about to ask what's over there, but I kind of knew the answer before I. <gasps> Altina, daughter, we must murder you in a card game. <laughs> Send mm. you to the shadow realm. Wife and daughter. Why is my nose itchy? Stop it. <laughs> Speaking of card games, I watched the finale of the original Yu Gi Oh show. And I liked it. I mean, the show's not perfect. It's kind of a guilty pleasure in certain respects. But I liked it. I mean, and I like those characters, too, so that helps. I don't it's a really good duel. It is. And it was. It was entertaining. Touches on some interesting subjects, back and forth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was invested. Most of the cards are correct. I was going to ask. It didn't seem like you were calling out a lot of cards of, like, that's not how that works. I mean, there were a couple, but there weren't, like... I feel like there were some... Uh, matches with like in the Pegasus era where like every duel was like no that's not how that works well, even a little bit the original show with Duelist Kingdom is just a goddamn <laughs> disaster <laughs> of you know a giant soldier of stone attacking the moon and oh, fortress yeah! falling on other monsters and blah blah it's blah it's like some of those things are creative but they don't actually make any sense no, with the card just game itself awful they're just <laughs> the writers being like, I don't know, throw something at it till it sticks. The holograms can do things right. Battle City starts to actually try to match up more with how the game is played, but then they still make several critical errors. I do love that Slifer, that the duel with Slifer and the Merrick possessing the mime or whoever. Mm -hmm. Yes, Strings. that one. Strings? Fantastic duel. Um, so, yeah. There was also a lot of uh, Deal or No Deal, <laughs> and the theme song is forever stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. um. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> He's just Anne Friend. Anne Friend. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, it's not, nice. buddy. But first, we intrude again. <laughs> you would be a good fit for guys. You might need to interact a little bit more, but I could see it. I think it's a better fit than anybody in the group. Not to say that there's a couple that don't make some sense, but I'm fine with it. No, yeah. that's just her pink hue reflecting on her face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure, yeah. Say what you want, Becky. Yeah, like Gaius and Lind are a relatively new development. There's been little like moments, but yeah, that's kind of Hugo goes back a ways. I was gonna say you guys have been around since day one. Now they've been separated for the most part ever since the Civil War, but nonetheless, uh, would... you guys fought constantly, which means you must be a couple. <laughs> uh... 
As always, we can't ever tell if with Becky it's a typo or just trying to use her accent. We don't know. Yeah, it's a little unclear sometimes. It gets dicey. Aw. That's cute. Probably not. Vita's probably just going to yeet off into space or something when this is all done. <laughs> yeah. <I didn't... laughs> She's not going to join the party. That's become clear. I, I Right? I know we, we've been wishing for that for like two games, and now I'm just like, at this point, it's not going to happen. I feel like if you were going to join, it would have happened. Could be in the final dungeon, but if, if Mil Mirage is really going to be off doing its own thing, then she's sort of predisposed. Mm -hmm. That's kind of my my thinking as well. Oh, we get to play both. Oh my god! Well, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna need to do multiple pom pom parties against Altina. We might as well get that out of the way since we know we're not gonna win on the first try. You don't know that. <laughs> don't die though. Don't die though. 13. I never really spent a lot of time thinking about what this could be. Oh, yeah. We, I feel like we asked, uh, talked about it like forever ago, and mm -hmm. now I don't remember who that could it's possibly next. be. Yeah, it's next. I guess we'll find out soon. Well, I just want, I'm just letting this go for a second just to showcase how fast she's playing. I was going to say, holy shit, she's moving. I'll she really wants to kill that, us. But I, nonetheless, I, I thought it was important to show. Well, I think it's important because we know we're not going to win this first round anyway. She's going to murder our ass, and then we're going to have to do it again. So I'm fine with it. <laughs> I'm honestly just watching her screen because it's closer to me and it's so I think fast. We should all do that. <laughs> they can understand the depths of my despair. I, I think so. Yes. Let's just watch Altina. She is just going to town. CP is just rising constantly. Oh no, Altina, you're so brutal. Okay, I'll go back to watching your screen now. I'll be supportive. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> Write me off like all of America has. <laughs> it fuels my motivation. Goodbye. No! Oh, it. Okay. Okay. We can recover that from this. That piece is awful! Ugh. That's not great. Okay, okay. Ah. It's still a little dicey. That it's also not really helpful for me. Yeah, it's really not. Why are people so aggressive with this mini game? Why is the AI like, I must win! <sighs> okay, we'll go defensive this time because I didn't have much offensively. We need to get a little bit of breathing room because I actually think this is doable. I'm going to prove you wrong. Oh my god, you're going to do it. You're doing it, Peter. Because this is the type of stuff that can happen now. Ooh, that was a very nice combo for us. That might be the most I've ever seen right. us do. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> it's fine. Well, now we're super defensive. Yeah, look how I'm beating her by so much right now. So these lines are going to keep pushing up over time. But <laughs> it's fine. I, I love it. I have to own up to my mistake. Oh, yeah. Mm, up there. I want to yell, please. Perfect. No. No. Oh, oh, that oh re God. That restarted the piece. Ooh. Restarted the piece, everybody. You saw where it was and where it ended up. Mm-hmm. You saw. That's some bullshit. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, what? Okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Why was it moving so fast all of a sudden? Okay. Well, it's all like I, I told you, America. I'm you sorry. Right. I, I did jinx you, though, I think. So that's... Um, I'll take some of the blame for that. <laughs> uh, man, the AI, though, they really want to win at this game. They are very aggressive about it. It's the one time they can best read in combat, because it's not going to happen in combat. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, it's true. It's like, we have to beat him in something. He can't be perfect all the time. Turns out he can. Sure. So before it jumps up, we'll clear out some space. And I guess to make this a chain, I need to play this a little weird. Mm, no, this is fine. Drop those and drop those. And it's a little weird. Unfortunately, how it breaks down there, but it's fine. Get this here. Get this going. Everything's fine. Everything's hunky dory. Until she drops more shit on me. Because of what she's going to do. Because as our daughter, she has taken after us in our stubborn aggression. I'm going to probably have to go defensive here or I'm dead. Because this roll and run out sucked. Mm -hmm. All right, back to work. Climb the mountain. 
Ooh, that's it. That's pretty good, though. That helps us. Well, that's a good outcome. Keeps us alive. I'll take what I can get. Please, no. Be gentle, daughter. Gentle. Bad daughters go to their room. <laughs> You're grounded if you beat me again. <laughs> I will not suffer this humility. <laughs> uh, sure. The most exciting channel on YouTube. We truly are. We are just, we're pushing the envelope of quality Let's Plays. Start attacking this from the side, hit this middle down a bit, because I'm a little bit worried that at any time. <laughs> <laughs> that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Who knew that this minigame would be the source of so much pain and misery? I certainly didn't. Yeah, it probably doesn't scale to difficulty like the battles do. It would be kind of silly if it did, right? No, that would be insane. Ah, <laughs> it hurts a lot. Okay. Okay. Wow, that was... Okay. I can kind of breathe again. That's nice. Altina, why? Because she hates us. <laughs> Turns out she's sick of us adopting her when she didn't ask for it. That's true. We didn't get consent. <laughs> really we, we don't do have that. adoption papers. We didn't go through any of the no, process. We didn't do the formal channels. We did nothing, really. No. And we just expected it all to work out for the best. We don't have any parenting experience. Oh, but none whatsoever. We just have friendship speeches and friendship speeches. And that doesn't pay the bills. It doesn't pay the bills, and it doesn't translate to being a good parent. You can't just friendship your way through parenting. Presents. Oh my god, do it! Oh. No! Well, she had to go defensive and she's still in trouble. Gotta put on the pressure here. Yep. I actually want to just put it this way, I think. We'll let her try and dig out. Okay. I don't think two lines would have killed her, so we're gonna do this. Clear some more space and then just hope that she self destructs. But she has very little CP, although it's about to change. But we're about to change some more, too. So we're going to hope that that was the right choice. Maybe it's not. Maybe that's wrong. Maybe we doomed ourselves. Who knows? Only one way to find out. Well, offensive, huh? Interesting. I also never thought I'd be hearing this theme song as much. Who knew? Yeah, but maybe we deep down we should have always known. Probably. I think resetting the piece is always very distracting. It is. I hate it. It really kind of messes up your flow. Mm -hmm. It's like they did this on purpose. <laughs> it is kind of like that, yeah. Yeah. It they... does feel that way, yes. Mm -hmm. um, They're spiting us. This is going to be gross. <laughs> <laughs> we can fight out of the middle at least. This will give us some room to breathe, but not quite how I wanted that to play out. But it's my fault. I did it. Mm -hmm. No. Okay, well, that oh. was going to be a chain over there, and now it's not. Now it's not. The chain I had set up that my eyes were on got blown up. No. And uh, this is going to be the entire Tuesday video. Welcome back. If I have to suffer, so do you. It's true. All right. People are texting me. Hold on. Is it, it about this? No. Oh. <laughs> we, we nothing will help us. We have to just suffer through this. Okay. <laughs> I thought maybe if I like an escape, you know, like throw a smoke ball or something. Ninja escape. Ninja escape. But alas, I just nope. have, I just have to play better. That's all. We just yeah. <laughs> Get good, Chris. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. 
don't like this board I've started. She's in a much better position than I am. Yeah, we didn't get the best start. And now she's doing a thing because of course she is because screw us and everything we love. I think we probably should have known this whole time that she hit this. It's just only now coming to our realization. And that's unfortunate. That would have been handy information before her. Yes. Uh, well. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> I... L <laughs> oh, God. Uh-huh. It got really bad really fast. Uh-huh. Oh, I looked I away died. for, like, two seconds. I no! I died. I could have played that green one to some success, but it's fine. Let's get off to a slightly better start than that because that was trash. I think I was disheartened from last time and my feelings were too hurt and I didn't want to win. Mm -hmm. And that's the excuse I'm going to go with. I, I think so. I think that's that's fair. All right, we're not horrendously behind on BP now. CP, excuse me. Yeah, we gotta get our game terms right. It's been too long. This will be too bad. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Well, since I can't really use this offensively, we just have to go defensive and hope to improve down the road. And maybe cry a little. So that's, that's I think important. we're crying, yes. A lot of crying is going to be happening. There's nothing wrong with crying, except for everything that's wrong with crying. <laughs> I would be crying right now, but I, I, I was distracting myself with my phone. So, now I'm not. That's a great story. <laughs> Really helps me in my time of need. <laughs> I mean, right. why is this game so hard? And, like, there isn't even, like, you can't get tips online. Like, it's just play the game. Play better. Play better, right? Like, there's really no tips for improving I mean, your it is, it is Tetris optional, thing. But I don't see it as such, so. Yeah. Plus, I mean, if it was just easier, it would be a... It would be a harmless game. Um, oh my god! Finally. Had to focus in. Okay, 8 U material. Now for the one we should kick her ass in. Yep. Famous last words! <laughs> You're not wrong. Oh my god, card games! This is so timely and relevant with our discussion like 10 minutes ago. All right, it's our old pal Witch, which we were close to switching to, but didn't. Mm -hmm. There's our new card. Uh, yeah, and there's the big boy. I didn't see who was going first, so this is just like the old days. Oh, I think she's going first? Mm. Yeah. Sorry, I could have told you that sooner. That's, um, that's my bad. <laughs> okay, well, just took four damage. That hurts. Why would you do that, Altina? Unfortunately for her... It's a Reku Palooza down I have here. nothing else to do, so stop. And play another one out with our extra mana, and uh, let's hope for better future turns. <laughs> uh, well, we can kill the Zamel Pen just by trading these two Rekus. Yeah. There's some other ways we could do it while still building a board, though, so I think what we'll do instead is swim here. Ow! No! And play this. Use its skill to kill here. Our other three mana goes here. And we shrug our shoulders. <laughs> and continue to slowly build that board presence. Okay. Down to 12 we go. <laughs> it hurts. I hate it. Uh, gotta keep the board clear, I think. Also, I have to keep sealing. Those are, I think, non-negotiable. Agreed. Because we can't afford any other damage that's going to keep hitting us. So, get out. <sighs> and while I'd love to get a Multimus down, I don't think that's very wise at the moment. So, stop. 
Now we have five mana left, and I think we desperately need to build a board presence. And the only way that five adds up correctly is to play this. And this. Not the strongest board I've ever had. <laughs> Feeling a little vulnerable right now. Okay, just a ranged dude. That's good. That's good. We can just murder that. That's great. Okay. <laughs> still got to keep sealing. I think that's still non-negotiable. We do have enough mana now to play our old pal of Ultimus and start a swinging. Because the longer this stretches out, the more likely we are to end up with some kind of nightmare scenario where, you know, she keeps whittling away with magic cards or something, and then I die. Mm-hmm. And we don't really want that. I don't want to die. I like living. Okay, living that's relatively nice. easy to clear. Um, so we have these. I don't want to put two of these in. Oh. They do have haste. But it's too important to do this first. And so we shall. Now with seven mana, I think the play is just to bring these out because these will not have an immediate board impact. The question then just becomes how best to deploy all of our damage. We unfortunately have two silvers up front, which are not great for killing this guy. Ah, uh, yeah. But what do I do with that? You know, I don't... I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I can't tell you. I, like, still don't know how to play this game, That's even though I damage. watch you play it every time. Double trade here. Kill the Dharma for five for no reason. It does seem like overkill. It does kind of seem like overkill. Is there any way I could get to lethal that I'm not seeing? I don't think so. And if, like, that shoots there, it's still, like, we have five, ten... 13. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I'm one off lethal no matter how I approach this. I'm trying to just look real quick to see if there's any other way. If we had anything that could kill this cleanly, we would have enough. Yeah. But I think no matter what I do, I have to double hit here. Unless it's a huge one, in which case I'd lose too much damage anyways. Mm -hmm. 2, 5, 7, 12. Yeah, because, I mean, what we have on board is 17 damage. But we can't cleanly spend three of it to get through here, so we can't have lethal. Yeah. What we can do is just hit him a couple times. Given that we can't kill this turn, I think I will wipe this out, even though it is severely overkill. It could heal it. And now mm -hmm. we just get to swing for seven. Now she's, play she's going two cards in hand, sealed. <laughs> there is a magic crystal or two in play. Superior Bell. Fife Null. Probably going to heal. Mm -hmm. All right. It's hard to imagine we don't have lethal here in some form or another. Make sure I don't accidentally kill myself. Because that would be awkward. Boy, would that be embarrassing. That's more embarrassing than losing Pom Pom Panic 19 times. Oh, yes, 100%. I lost. Yes, you did, sweet child. Ooh, <laughs> you gave us droplets, though. Thank you. But you tried your best. You sure did. That's commendable. Oh, God, Monk, what are you doing here? I forgot you were on the ship. <laughs> I'll be playing at. Yep. So one thing that happened while we were gone is the other Crossbell game got its official release with the, well, <laughs> its official fan-made release. So those oh, two are both like so those are edited and ready to go. Oh, uh, so we could potentially do those next is what you're saying. Good. We'll see what you happens. Know, I kind of like the idea. <laughs> this is so dumb. But I like the idea of going backwards in the chronology. Since we've already started with the last one, going backwards is kind of silly and hilarious at the same time. I mean... And I don't think we'll get uh -oh. Hajimari before we play at least one of those. So that could certainly fill Email some space. on Memorial Day! Ah! 
Unacceptable! Yes, I am still working. Yeah. All right. Very good. Up. Oh. <gasps> What's up? Dracony. Oh, is that like, like intense, basically? Um, it's more like old and outdated in uh, a somewhat intense way. Okay. All right. I got you. Well, don't worry. When the world's about to blow up... <laughs> You're not wrong, that. buddy. You're not wrong. <laughs> he just accepts it. Oh, you're my favorite. But that's that, that is a thing you just said, but that's fine. You know, just repeat yourself. He just really does not want to sing with Machias again. <laughs> he just really wants to make that clear. Just to make it abundantly clear, I hate Machias. I don't know if you've noticed. <laughs> I but think... I also love him. <laughs> we are the literal definition of um, a love-hate relationship. You know, you look up that definition and they are the picture in the dictionary, you know? Just the two of them with like a heart around them. Oh my god. And then we can go snowboarding. <laughs> and then kill myself when I have to chase sheep down the slopes and fail a whole bunch. <laughs> Alrighty. Alright, I think we've done it. I think we've talked to every single... Okay. What are you up to now, Cerberus? No, apparently I've stand corrected. <laughs> Stark, it's cute that you're uh, you're gonna pretend that you can speak, dog. I love alternative means. <laughs> this dog is um, <laughs> hyper intelligent. Hyper intelligent, yes. It's a little disarming, but this is also why we don't screw around with Cerberus. Well, we know. Oh, okay. Mm. What has your life become? What? I mean, that's a fair question, dude. This dog is running the show. <laughs> Why are you staring at us as you're saying? I mean, I know, but you like you have a list. You should be looking at your list. And she's just staring at us instead. It's a little it's a little disarming. You are intense. I'm just, I'm gonna run away shortly here. There we go. We're very scared. <laughs> Last floor. Well, we gotta go to the deck, I suppose. But that won't take long. There's usually not that many people out there. Or are there? Famous last words. <laughs> As everyone congregates into the same space. Oh, yeah, we put her in her, like, retro-ish outfit. It's not as red as the old one, but it's still pretty good. Although, maybe it's just the lighting in here. Joshua's harmonica was the best, even though we couldn't actually hear a harmonica. I'm still a little sad about that. At least not prominently. Not prominently, anyway. It should have had its own goddamn solo is what it should have had. <laughs> that sounds vaguely familiar. Mm -hmm. Oh god, no. Burn it! No! No! Do it! No! Do it, cowards! You won't! <laughs> Yeah, that would be a way to torture them. Yeah, sure is. We saw that, too. Mm -hmm. Let's focus on surviving first, though. They're all so cheerfully optimistic. I'll help. Come back soon. Oh, no. Here we go. Oh, my God. Just one. You spared us? Oh! <gasps> Amazing. Amazing. Uh, grumpiness. Oh, my God. 
two of the most grouchiest people in the same space. <laughs> this fellow. <laughs> wow, it's kind of rude, actually, Professor. The question is, does he like the coffee? Or does he hate it because he hates everything? Oh my god, he doesn't hate it. Like, what a... That's not a real thing. <laughs> They're making that up. The baristas in Starbucks definitely do not take that into account when they're brewing coffee. <laughs> they just make it. A minus is a pretty strong first grade. I from mean, Schmidt. that's pretty good, Machias. You um. But he's still disappointed. But he, by he's it. like, I I'm an A plus boy. I've never had an A minus in my life. A plus or nothing. <laughs> 